A manhunt comes to an end. Police arrested the man accused in the shooting of 10 people on a Brooklyn subway. Frank James is charged with a federal terrorism offense. Police say that he set off smoke grenades and fired a gun more than two dozen times. We want to warn you, some viewers may find this video that you're about to see disturbing. Gloria Pasmino reports. Police have arrested Frank James, 62 years old, accused of perpetrating that attack on the subway yesterday where he opened fire inside one of the subway cars, injuring at least 16 people, 10 of them shot. The police uh, have told us the investigation into exactly what went on yesterday continues. New York City police say they've arrested 62-year-old Frank James, the man they now call a suspect in Tuesday's subway shooting. James spoke heavily about violence in multiple rambling videos posted online, including what appears to be his latest video posted just one day before the shooting. I wanted to kill people. I wanted to watch people die right in front of my face immediately. But I thought about the fact that, hey man, I don't want to go to no prison. The videos posted by James give some insight into his trip to New York City. In one of the videos, James says he left his home in Wisconsin on March 20th and was heading to the, quote, danger zone. We need to see more mass shootings. Yeah, you need does not know. We need to see more. That's be more mass shootings. Police say James rented this U-Haul van on April 11th in Philadelphia. The U-Haul was found in Brooklyn Tuesday after keys to the vehicle were found at the scene of the subway attack. Investigators also linking the gun found at the scene to James and tracking the purchase of a gas mask to James through eBay. That's according to law enforcement officials. The manhunt for James may be over, but the healing for victims is just beginning. I still feel the pain. Um, they gave me a bunch of pain meds, but I, it's still there. I can still feel it. I can still see the hole. I don't think I'm going to ever, I don't think I could ever ride the train again. At this time, 10 people remain hospitalized. James has been charged in Brooklyn federal court. He is accused of violating a law that prevents uh, any uh, terrorist or other violent attacks on a public mass transit system. That is the very latest. Gloria Pasmino in Brooklyn. Back to you.